Politicians and dignitaries have been arriving at Parliament all afternoon. Let's go find out what's on all of their minds. Uh, I just googled and I found something very nice. Definitely is an economy, though we understand that is international phenomenon, the economy, but South Africa will have to put its own effort, which I think the President will talk about it, especially in man manufacturing, the problems in mining, but more so, everybody understands that the best answer we can get at the present moment when it comes to economy is agriculture. Well, I had to follow my wife's choice. Good, and, very good. And try to fit myself to what she had decided. The, you know, the difficulties facing our country can and will be overcome. I think South Africans need to have hope in the midst of gloom. We say in the, in the democracy, um, the freedom of speech. People can say everything they want to say, but what we know that 62% um, of the majority of this country voted for Zuma. So people like 1,000 people can say Zuma must fall. I don't know where they can take that thing. I do feel, well, partly this dress is a celebration dress, according to her. Uh, Tuesday was great, not because it was the winner takes it all. It was great because we all came together to embrace our constitution. Ultimately, the judges will decide, but just the spirit was a spirit of understanding and a spirit of accepting the supremacy of the constitution. We are used to these shenanigans, but I can assure you nothing will stop the president from finishing his speech tonight. Nobody. Nobody will stop the president. This parliament is capable of dealing with that, and we're capable. They've got the right to do that, but uh, uh, there's nothing that's going to stop the president from finishing his speech. That I can assure.